Yo, what up though? Man, what did we just witness on Black Friday? The New York Jets offense laid a big ass egg. And I'm not mad at the defense. The defense did what the defense is going to do. They scored a touchdown, but the offense ain't show up. Y'all benched Zach Wilson for Tim Boyle, and he was horrible. He passed the ball today. I'm not going to lie to y'all, man. I can't make this shit up. 38 times, and he ain't had 200 passing yards. He had two interceptions and one lousy-ass touchdown pass. <laughs> like, let's be for real. The quarterbacks in New York just been horrible, man. Aaron Rodgers went down with an injury, and y'all should have been on the phone with somebody off rip trying to trade for a quarterback. To me, trading for Aaron Rodgers was a big mistake. Aaron Rodgers was not that good of a quarterback last year in Green Bay. So why would you trade for Aaron Rodgers like, like y'all land like that? Like your offensive line is shaky. Like y'all not land like that to trade for a quarterback like that and think we just can run the football and do some play action passes and we going to win some football games? No, hell no. And your defense ready to say F it for the rest of the season for real. Because like what are y'all doing on offense? The offense ain't doing nothing. I blame this on the GM and the head coach. That's why they will be fired in midseason. I'll probably give them two or three more weeks for them to be a head coach and a GM of a national football team. Because the shit the New York Jets display on the first ever Black Friday game in the, in the NFL era was just horrible. The Miami Dolphins, man, put up 34 points, man. Like, like let that sink in. They ran for 167 rushing yards on y'all. Yeah, Waddle went off today for 114 pack, uh, receiving yards. Tyreek Hill has 102 receiving yards. The DBs in the offense is saying F the football team, man, because they don't care about nothing, man. Because we ain't bringing no quarterback in when Aaron Rodgers went down to compete for the starting job. Everybody know Zach Wilson ain't no starting quarterback in the NFL. Like, how you don't know that? That's why y'all will get fired at the end. It ain't going to be the end of the season. It's going to be mid-season where y'all get y'all fucking walking papers, man. And I will understand why. The New York Jets have a nice defense. It's the offense. Y'all had nice weapons on offense. I like Brees Hall. I like Wilson, the wide receiver. I like Crunklin, the tight end y'all got from Minnesota. But the, the quarterback play is horrible. Y'all could have got Josh Dobbs. Like the Minnesota Vikings trade for Josh, Josh Dobbs for nothing. Y'all could have got a lot of other quarterbacks, man. But y'all chose to roll the dice with Zach Wilson and Tim Boyle and the shit backfired. So that's why y'all will be fired, man, before the end of the season, man. And y'all will be looking for another job throughout the offseason, man. The, the the head coach, Robert, he going to get another job. He a nice D.C. But the GM, I don't know. Because the, the Aaron Rodgers move to me was a big mistake, man. But that just me. I would have I would have tried to put a play in for Lamar Jackson or another quarterback and see what happened. But at the end of the day, man, y'all ties y'all career and y'all New York Jets tender to Aaron Rodgers and Zach Wilson in the fail job. That was a big mistake, man. I wasn't gonna trade for no no Asian quarterback like Aaron Rodgers, and he had a down year last year. Aaron Rodgers looked horrible last year in the Green Bay Packers. I don't think Aaron Rodgers last year threw for over 300 passing yards, but y'all still traded for Aaron Rodgers like he was the missing link. No, y'all will be the missing link in the New York Jets when I replace y'all asses for a new head coach in the gym, man. The shit I seen today was just horrible, man. But y'all let me know in the comment section below, man. Should New York Jets keep the head coach in the gym or should they fire their ass and hire a new head coach in the gym? I seen enough of their motherfucking offense. I'm tired of seeing that raggedy ass offense, especially on prime time. Like, why the NFL ain't flex that game and put somebody else on a Black Friday? I ain't want to see no damn New York Jets against the Miami Dolphins. Like the New York Jets, the New York Jets offense is horrible. They don't even have a quarterback. I probably can go out there right now and play quarterback for the New York Jets and have more success than the quarterbacks they got in the damn quarterback room.